Man, the type of beat I'm making right here is something that, that's gonna give you a little a little thump, man. Something you can feel. I like to hear that knock sometimes. You know, um, you know, the type of beats I make, they vary, but this one right here in particular, it's something that you're gonna really be able to feel. So I got some hard hitting kicks. I got a little 808 here and there, man, to, to follow up right there with that kick. Uh man, I, I think I got let me see what it is. I wanna say it's uh, you know, I got my down south snare, of course, man. Hey, represent North Carolina to the fullest. Fay nah. <laughs> Uh, my synth, of course I got the synth in there, and I got a uh, arpeggiator, you know, you gotta have your arpeggiator give you a little bounce here or there. So let me go ahead and back it up right here. Oh, and by the way, if you didn't know, I'm actually using um, Machine to make this beat here. So like, um, sometimes I use Logic, you know, it depends on how I'm feeling, you know, if I feel like making some type of sample bass beat, or if I really want to go deeper within a sample, I, I probably use Machine, but um, for the most part, I really like to use Logic for my mixing, my mastering, and uh, to really bring out my sounds and, and to really make my my sound a lot fuller, if you know what I mean. So um, I, I kind of switch between both, you know. I can't really say I use one in particular, so it's kind of hard to really tell. All right, so let me see. Let me see if I can go ahead and try to build this beat for you and let you guys kind of hear kind of how I, how I put this one together. Um, so of course. I actually started off with the keys with this beat here. You know, you hear that right there? I started off just like that. Kind of found a tune. Let me run that back for you. Actually, it's higher pitch. There we go. So, of course, man, I brought a song in like that. Run that back for you. So. To back that, the keys up a little bit, you know, I threw a little arpeggiator in the back. A little synth arpeggiator. So let me go ahead and... You hear that? So I mean, of course, after that, man, um, by this time you already know what gotta come next. So I gotta add some feel to this this track, some some way or another. So with that being said, let me go ahead and toss some kick on in there. Definitely a kick. Definitely a kick and snare. So start off with the kick, kick and snare, of course. Gotta get my rhythm, my flow. kick up with an 808 so as you can see I kind of I threw a, a crash in there too because I like to really catch the I like to catch people's attention man um Without my beats, like I said, I like to really bring my beats alive. So it's not it's not really just what you hear, man. It's kind of what you feel as well. So I try to like you know merge the two, if you know what I mean. So with those crashes, what it's really doing, man, is like it's catching your attention. That's the best way I can really put it. 
Chance of some of the beats, you know what I mean? That's all it is. So, run that back for you. So, along with that, man, of course, like I said, I like to really do my beats live. So, I don't like to add too much, but I like to add things that's gonna fit in areas to really make the whole beat full, cool, you know what I mean? If you're looking for me or you want to find me, you can find me on Instagram or Twitter at TaylorFamousQ or you can find me on SoundCloud at SoundCloud.com slash TaylorFamous. Also, guys, make sure you check out my website, SuperDomeNation.com, and it's a mass media network where we work with artists, entertainers, and entrepreneurs, and we want them to do what they love while we share it with the world. In other words, what we do is do interviews, promo videos, music videos. We're here for the artists and we're really trying to help promote and get their talents out there, man. So, hey, check us out. <laughs>